Welcome to the lap of luxury, and today we'll be looking at the top 10 wealthiest people on earth and their journeys to becoming the most successful people in the world. Join me as we examine the top 10 richest people on earth in 2022. First up here, but not even close to being number one, is Larry Ellison. With a net worth of $87.2 billion, Larry Ellison, like many others on this list, attributes his vast fortune to the advancement of technology. After dropping out of college in 1977, he founded Oracle and grew it from a startup to one of the world's largest software and database firms. Oracle's current market valuation is $187 billion. Oracle is a company that has helped change the world and wouldn't be possible without him. Up next is a guy you might have seen on television during the NBA games for the Los Angeles Clippers. The great Steve Ballmer is at our number 9 spot. The former Microsoft CEO and current owner of the Los Angeles Clippers has a net worth of $92 billion. Ballmer's achievements stem from both his contributions to the team and his continued ownership of Microsoft stock. Ballmer's journey began in 1980 when he decided to drop out of Stanford's MBA program. He was 24 at the time and decided that he would join a startup company that many of you now know today as Microsoft. Now, the Microsoft of today is a much larger company than it was when Ballmer joined. At the time, Ballmer became only Microsoft's 30th employee. In 2014, he retired from Microsoft as a billionaire, while also paying $2 billion for an NBA team, the Los Angeles Clippers. Since 2014, he has increased his philanthropy, contributing more than $2 billion to a donor-advised fund with the goal of lifting Americans out of poverty. It's always nice to see someone with his financial status and success give back to others who are not as fortunate. Next up at number 8 on this list is another technological genius, Sergey Brin. Don't be surprised to see Sergey Brin at number 8 on this list. With his net worth amassing to $95 billion, he's one of the world's richest men. Sergey Brin certainly earned every dollar that he's worth today. After all, where would we be without the guy who gave us Google and changed our lives forever? Brin's story is the definition of the American dream. When Brin was only six years old, he and his family immigrated to the United States from the Soviet Union. He earned his bachelor's degree at the University of Maryland. He then enrolled in Stanford to earn a PhD in computer science, where he would later meet Larry Page and go on to found Google. Next up on this list is someone who is not a technological genius, but someone with more knowledge about stocks than Wall Street itself. Number 7. Warren Buffett from paperboy to billionaire, Buffett amassed a fortune of $96.4 billion, a story about rising through the ranks to become one of the world's wealthiest men. Warren Buffett is the most well-known stock investor alive today, and his buy and hold technique is what he attributes to his high net worth. He first purchased shares in Berkshire Hathaway in 1962, becoming the majority stakeholder in 1965. In 1967, Buffett decided to invest the money of Berkshire Hathaway into insurance companies and retail businesses. This would later turn out to be the decision that took Berkshire Hathaway to the moon. Today, a single-class A share of Berkshire Hathaway is trading for more than $400,000, and the current market capitalization of the company is $705 billion and still going up. I'll tell you something, don't bring up Bitcoin with Warren Buffett. He made his fortune with old-fashioned money and is skeptical of New Age digital currency. It's always hard to teach an old dog new tricks. Next up on our list is ranked number 6 and trying to climb even higher, Adani. Recently increasing his net worth by $225 million and finally surpassing $97 billion, Adani's net worth is $98 billion. This now also makes him the richest man in India and Asia, succeeding Mukesh Ambani for the top spot. Adani's entrepreneurial tenants are directly descended from his father, who owned a textile company. Even though Adani could have inherited the business, he wasn't very interested in it. Instead, he wanted to make a lot of money on his own. Soon after leaving home, Adani entered the diamond market and quickly became a millionaire. With the money he made from the diamond market, he formed Adani Enterprises a conglomerate that now handles many industries and sectors such as energy, transportation, mining, infrastructure, logistics, cement, and fast-moving consumer products. Over the last year, Adani's stock market success, new investments, and green energy have added more than $40 billion to his net worth, propelling him to the top 10. Who knows, one day, Adani could be number one on this list. 
Take a wild guess at who's next on the list. You might recognize his name as it was mentioned in the video earlier. If you guessed right, then you know number five on the list is Larry Page. Did you know that Larry Page co-founded Google when he was only 23 years old? Larry Page, like several other software millionaires on our list, began his path to fame and fortune in a college dorm room in 1995. While Page was a student at Stanford University, he and his friend Sergey Brin came up with the concept of enhancing internet data extraction due to its ability to examine backing links. The team created a new search engine technology that changed the world. The developments not only changed the world, but paid off for Page too, literally. Worth a whopping $99 billion, Page has more money than he even knows what to do with. Next up is someone who is also responsible for the evolution of technology. Ranked number four on the list, I present to you, Mr. Bill Gates. Bill Gates is only worth $115 billion, and yes, I did say only. He was a real whiz kid when he was young, creating his first software program when he was only 13 years old. It's almost like he was destined for it. Fulfilling his destiny, Bill would go on to become the co-founder of Microsoft, which is now the world's largest computer software firm. Gates is the reason Microsoft is the company it is today and what he attributes to his high net worth. Bill has now resigned from Microsoft in order to devote his time to the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation. I'd say Mr. Gates definitely earned his retirement. Up next is someone who made their billions not off being a tech genius, but by being a fashion killer. Rank number three is Bernard Arnold. Meet the Pope of Fashion, the man with a golden touch in the world of fashion. A French national, Bernard Arnault, did not come from a fashion background. His father owned a construction company. However, this is where he got his first taste of economic aptitude. Currently, he is the chairman and CEO of LVMH, the world's largest luxury goods conglomerate. LVMH owns brands such as Louis Vuitton, Hennessy, Marc Jacobs, and Sephora. The majority of Arnold's forgings stem from his massive investment in Christian Dior, the holding company that controls 41.3% of LVMH. His shares in Christian Dior, plus an additional 6.2% in LVMH, are held through his family-owned holding form, Group Familial. I'm sure you've heard of some of those brands just mentioned and can see why Mr. Barnard is top three on this list. This next guy started his entrepreneurial journey out of his garage and is now the second richest man on earth. Ranked at number two on our list is Jeff Bezos. $133 billion. Jeff Bezos amassed his fortune by starting an online bookstore out of his garage. Starting his journey at the age of 30, Bezos quit his job in finance and began his online library, also known as Amazon. What started as an online bookstore quickly turned into a marketplace where consumers could buy and sell virtually anything, as well as one of the most sophisticated logistical organization platforms in the world. Since stepping down as CEO of Amazon in 2021, Mr. Bezos has explored other ventures such as aerospace technology and suborbitable spaceflight. $133 billion is a lot, but it's nowhere near where the net worth of our top spot is. What could he be planning next? Ranking at number one on the list is Elon Musk, who is worth a whopping $210 billion. Elon was born in South Africa and received his bachelor's degree in physics and economics from the University of Pennsylvania. Today, he's known as one of the most enterprising, smart, and creative entrepreneurs in the world. The man who sent his roadster to space is laughing all the way to the bank with not only his success at Tesla, but also with the path-breaking milestones in batteries and electric cars. However, Tesla is not his only company. Musk's aerospace engineering firm, SpaceX, has seen phenomenal success with sustainable reusable rockets and has also helped NASA take astronauts back to the space station. The success with SpaceX allowed Musk to secure a contract with NASA to build them a moon lander for an upcoming Mars mission. Musk is unstoppable. He is by far the world's richest man and now his next conquest is constructing the fastest land transportation system the world has ever seen. Elon Musk has accomplished some pretty amazing things in business and new technology and you can see why he's at the top of this list. With that concludes the top 10 richest people on planet Earth. What do you guys think? Will Elon Musk remain at number 1 forever or can someone catch up to him? Let me know what you think in the comment section below. Once again, this is Lap of Luxury. Please like, subscribe, and click the post notification button so you never miss a video.
You don't want to live in the lap of luxury. You want to be the lap of luxury.